this is Jody from Jody's Gems Quilting, and I learned something new today. And I want to remember this just in case I ever need it down the road, and it might help you too. We bought three new exterior doors. And I didn't want to pay the extra money to have them pre-painted, so I get to paint them. But they come with these little pegs right there and all these little screw holes. And after three doors, I finally figured out the trick. There is a trick to this. This piece right here has a little flat notch on it. Do you see it? And it fits in here and there's a flat spot right there that it goes into. And I have struggled. I've put them in straight. I've, whoops, put them in straight. I've put them in all different ways. I found the easiest and the best way is to put it in straight, just like that, and then slide it in. Now, not all of them go in perfectly. Some of them are too big, but before I was having to hammer a lot of them in, I was, um, it was a mess. And my thumb hurt so bad, I felt like I was shoving them into... A tiny little hole. Now we'll see if this one goes in just as easily. You see it? And then you just push it in. Yeah, the grain of the the wood grain on it doesn't always line up. But let me tell you, this is the way to do it. So if I ever move again, which is more than likely, and I buy new doors, which this is the best investment. It's just taken me a couple months to get around to putting these in. But you have to line it up, get it so that it's like almost flat in there. See, now that one did not go. It did not go easily. So it's almost like I have to put it in straight. Yep, there we go. And sometimes I'd have to hammer it in a little bit more. And when I did that, I actually put a towel down because I almost broke the window. That would not be good. And this line, it seems like some of them just are too small. Literally too small. Okay, that's as good as I'm going to get. But what I do is I take, I can't do it two-handed. But I take a towel, put it down. I put my fingers on the window or the glass to make sure I don't break the glass. And then I lightly tap it in. Anyway, I hope this helps me when I need to remember it someday. And hopefully it'll help you too. Have a great day.